So, why are you hating on Shikari Richardson? Now, the reason I'm talking about this is because it's a mind state that just doesn't make sense to me. This young lady who's just turned 21 shattered a world track record that has not been beaten in 30 years. And she reminds me of Flojo. <clears throat> Yet, for some reason, there are men that are just going out of their way to disrespect her. Okay, you don't like her hair, you don't like her nails, whatever. You don't have to go online and say things. Now, if there was an actual reasoning behind it to where it actually made sense, okay, but you don't have to denigrate a human being. And I'm starting to see these debates come up and conversations, and I think it goes back to the idea of hating. Like, what is the necessity of hating on somebody? It's always easier to, in my opinion, to congratulate because I hear a lot of people, they base their success by how many people hate them. But truth be told, love and admiration actually lasts longer in history because the moment you die, the hate stops anyway. So hate is only temporary where love always stretches further. That's why when you see somebody pass away, they're always talking about the good things about them afterwards. So what's the necessity in hating? It's a waste of time. There's no real purpose for it because to say, hey, I see you out there. Congratulations. What did that actually take away from you? If anything, you help somebody else feel better. And that's the point. I make my jokes like, man, I woke up drinking my haterade today. But that's it. It's just a joke. But to actually get online, start thumb thugging and typing. Yeah, I got something for you. Why? Because you're never going to run into these people. You're never going to have these type of discussions and you probably wouldn't even say it to them when you say when you seen them in person because you'd either be starstruck, I mean starstruck, awestruck, or you're just a coward anyways. And it's a sad thing when this becomes your mental state. This is something you definitely want to correct. You don't want this to be the way that you're perceived and viewed as a human being because now that guy who made that comment they are destroying him i mean they are going for the gusto right now because they're looking at him like who gave you the right to disrespect a young black woman who has worked her tail off to make it to the olympics and i'm kind of inclined to agree with it honestly like i don't even see the purpose in it talking about she's got masculine energy you know fake eyelashes fake hair all of that okay it's not like you trying to date her now if you wanted to mentor her or something like that you could hit her up later but you didn't have to try to disrespect her or hate on her on the internet you, you, you get what i'm saying like sometimes that's not a necessity you know i think these people look at certain individuals and think that they can mimic that style and it doesn't work like that because you're outright going to do and cause a problem where people are calling in asking for advice to complete different things but that was my thoughts on it don't be a hater show love to everybody because everybody deserves it unless you're just mean <laughs> but remember like share comment and subscribe and show your boy love all right everybody peace